I wouldn't hey, know. good evening, welcome down to Matt. You look like the unknown comic. No, you look like the unknown comic. Jared, what's que up? Pasa, Bato. We got guitar accompaniment tonight. Jared joining us in studio, and Billy Wack is reading a magazine. What do you got there? Well, actually, I figured I'd keep it slightly wrestling flavor this evening, and that's why we're going with WWE Magazine. Now, there's been a lot of critiques of the show saying, at least on my part, that I'm always talking about toys or wrestling or, you know, whatever, what have you. But uh, in this WWE Wrestling Magazine, there's a full-on video game review, and then they give a video, or they give a music album review. Right. So if WWE can talk about all kinds of media, right. then I can. Right. And look at what they did. Check it out. They review the Spider-Man game, and they have the Bad News Brown ratings key. Five Bad News Brown heads is good news. Four Bad News Brown heads, Ghetto Blaster. Three Harlem Sewer Rat. Two Spineless Cockroach. And one Bad News Brown head on the Bad News Brown rating key means you are a beer-bellied sharecropper. So how many Billy Whack heads does CM Punk get? He gets no Billy Wack hair. <laughs> None. I don't know. Anyway, fans, welcome Next to ECW the World Champion, I predict, by the way. I pred Billy predict. Wack, Richard T. Sin, Here Jared over there on guitar. I am Trevor Blanchard. We have an action-packed hour for you. Upcoming first, AWA Slam from Carol Stream. What up, champion <laughs> Steve Stone, the AWA Slam heavyweight champion, taking on Ricky Thomas. Uh, our second match will be from Ringside Pro Wrestling featuring... Justin Adams taking on Silas Young. And then our main event, fresh off of uh, this past May, Windy City Pro Wrestling Battle of the Belts 19, Christopher Daniels from NW, well, TNA, Total Nonstop TNA, Action, right. versus Abaddon. Nonstop. Abaddon versus and Christopher you were there. Daniels. I was there. This match does not have play by play. We're going to dress it up on the mat style the way we should. It's going to sound like week. commentary is going to be on the moon. Yeah, with no well, background it's going to be noise. fun. It'll have that Billy Wax spin on it. We're looking forward to it. But I was there. I was in attendance. It was a great match. It was a great battle of the belts. And big thanks out to Chris Hedford for filming this. Yes, Nicholas H., our producer's own son, Chris Hedford filmed this one. And he did a heck of a job. Just like I think we had a match by that he filmed a couple weeks back that was really good. He did a heck of a job it's just so exciting to get this footage so early and uh you know me well, i've got a special yin for windy city what can i say well things actually run a heck of a lot smoother when chris is behind the scenes as opposed to his dad oh we owe it all to him yeah we owe it all to him and everything else so god you're cold trevor <laughs> cold trevor cold, well he's got to be bitter he's wearing that cubs jersey well, you know what? They're in second place. As we taped today, they were, they're in second place, five games out. What? So, oh, so you really? guys follow yeah. baseball? No. I, well, I see, like, oh, train wreck, the Cubs. And, and like, I just thought, <laughs> really? They're really in second place? Yeah, so you're in second wow. place behind well, the Milwaukee Brewers. And well, then, by the time this airs, it'll be another sad story for Cubs yeah, fans it'll be in everywhere. Way. They yeah. might be in the World Series. No, oh, who knows? Oh, yeah. Maybe. I, I voted for Bush, I know. Yeah. I <laughs> ought <laughs> 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 Anyways, uh, you guys have a good weekend. What did you guys do? I had a great weekend. Uh, a week back, I went to the roller derby, and then I got to talk about... When are we going to have them on? Well, I've been working on it. I've been, Believe me, I've been working on those roller girls. Okay. I've been working long and hard, but... Uh, <laughs> For those of you that like a, roller derby, we're going to be showing some roller derby and actually maybe have the girls in here And there's basically, around. I found out there's just two groups. There's Windy City Rollers also. There's Chicago Sirens and there's Windy City Rollers. Do, do, is there competition? Do they like... Hey, yeah, yeah, and there's a lot... chicks. Yeah, and, and <laughs> some of these chicks are tough chicks, Billy. Wow. No, no. <laughs> They'll wow. knock you down, yeah. Did they braid their armpit hair? I, yeah, I got the feeling, yeah. Trevor's but what's ideal cool, date. when yeah. you go to the, when you go yeah. to the one in Linwood, yeah. I, we got to wind this up, Nichols H says, but when you go to the one in Linwood, they sell $4 tall boys of old style Whoa. and half blue ribbon, bad beer. Any any promotion that sells bad beer, that's a good deal. Wow. you got to love bad beer at a high price. Well, anyways, yeah, yeah. AWA Slam from Carol Stream. Steve Stone, the champion, oh, taking on Ricky Thomas. We got the uh, tornado, and uh, let's go to that match now. I have it on Nicholas H's authority. These are all great matches tonight. AWA, oh, look at this outdoors. Wow. I love it. Look who the ref is. Oh, yeah. oh, I feel like I'm outside. Nicholas H letting that pony freak flag fly. And of course, uh, Steve Stone, he's one of the other uh, guys we see here almost all the time. He's like one of the unofficial stars of On the Mat. Nice this drop the, kick by Ricky Thomas. From what I understand, though, all these matches are really good tonight. Ricky Thomas, he does look familiar. 
I've, I've never seen him. He's wrestle. Who did he wrestle he a few looks weeks like he, ago? I think he was walked through Windy City for like 10 seconds one time. But I, I, that kid looks familiar. <laughs> and who's this guy on the outside? Is that the uh, Wiley know. manager with the uh, sunglasses on? Well, he certainly does look Wiley, Richard T. Sin. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Stoic almost. <laughs> but uh, nonetheless, uh, from what I understand, this is not a glitch. We do not have to holler at Nicholas H. in the control room. Right to the eyes. There's no sound in this match, but I could oh, just see I could just see Nicholas H admonishing Ricky Thomas for that rake to the eyes. And he's letting him know and he's making that count. Boom! Oh, and he goes the to the middle. Rope. Wow. How scenic, too. They got a gazebo behind know, the I, match. It's very calming watching this match. Boom. Yeah, it's yeah. funny if there was a wedding going on in the gazebo. Yeah, yeah. yeah it almost reminds me of the opening scene of Enter the Dragon with Bruce Lee. Ah. Ooh, when he does that Chinese boxing. I know Chinese boxing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta love it. And you can see a girl in the uh, third row there slapping her brother slash boyfriend. I don't know. On the back. She's paying Ricky attention. Thomas up to the top row. Whoa, look Two, at him punches. Three. Look at that! Now that's pro wrestling! And Nicholas H is just kind of lollygagging on the count. Well, I'll tell you this though, that Ricky Thomas was punching him in the face, and there he goes wow. down on Dream Street. This is good stuff. Nicholas, Nicholas H. H. Oh, hey Nick, can you turn this up a little? He brought us a winner. Wait a minute, oh. he's got the cover. Oh, that's right, I'm sorry. Steve Stone gets out of it. This is this is very well shot. Did Chris Hedford shoot this one as well, Nick? No, actually, uh You did, right? No. Uh, a lady named uh, Rosemary Dillman. Rosemary okay. Dillman did a very Rosemary, wonderful job. You. She did a That's wonderful fantastic. job, and, and on the mat would like to uh, commend Ooh. her right here tonight for a wonderful shot match, and we're really enjoying it here. Thank you, Nicholas H., for supplying us every week with really cool wrestling and our forum on the mat, because it's a ball coming here, guys. Every week. Yep. It's an adventure. <laughs> yeah, we're getting to know each other pretty good. We, we, we talk the whole time. We don't even have to turn on the cameras. We just have a good... In good... fact, you know, sometimes I forget they're even on. Yeah, we just have a good conversation about wrestling because we're three guys that love wrestling. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. It's a good thing. Nicholas H. down for the count. Oh, look at this. A bla It was a choke by Steve Stone. I think Nicholas H. is trying to kill a grasshopper that is crawling <laughs> into the cicada. ring. A cicada. A cicada. <laughs> cicada mania running wild, and Nicholas H. is on top of it. Yeah, and this poor guy's walking. He's with his kid. He doesn't want to be on the mat. Just... small or sunset flip Whoa. two. This poor uh, family man in the background. He's going to be on on the mat. He probably didn't sign a release or nothing. He's going to wind up on national TV, knowing wow. On YouTube, Some there goth you go. Chick just got a cell phone camera to work. Fantastic. This is this One, is clear as a bell. Two. You can see a father in the back walking his young daughter up closer to the wrestling action. Perhaps <laughs> her first time at one of these events. Fantastic. <laughs> you got to love it. Taking it all in and enjoying it right here. Ooh, big Whoa. knee lift by Steve Smith. Wow, man, Nicholas, Nicholas H, H felt that, that one. Yeah. <laughs> Achi Wawa. Here we go. Steve Stone lo looks like he's loading up that or uh, fixing up that uh, arm uh, piece he's got on Ooh. there. That uh, brace. Elbow brace. Yeah, I don't know if he's got something in there. He's just Steve Stone climbing up. Looks like we're wow. going for a moonsault. Can he hit this? Whoa! Oh, oh, oh he Ricky can, Thomas but nobody's there away. to take the move. That was the bad part. Oh, oh yeah. spear. There he goes. Going for the pin. One, one two, two, three. That's Ricky it. Thomas, big win for Ricky. Wow. That, that was a good match. It was shot well. And I'm excited. Ricky Thomas got a win over Steve Stone. That's something I didn't expect to see right here tonight on the mat. That's pretty good stuff. It Nicholas was. H. bringing us a winner. Very good. Yeah, it was all it was all like crystal clear. It was almost like the HD of cable action. Yeah. <laughs> By the time this airs, it'll look like a third generation VHS copy. Yeah. yeah what's so what'd that? you do the weekend? Uh, this weekend, I actually DJed a show at a bar in Dwight, Illinois. Where is Dwight, Dwight Illinois? South. It was very south. So, but, isn't it by Kankakee? But it was by Kankakee. But to their credit, they had uh, Schlitz, Pabst, <laughs> Blatz, and Old Style in cans, and I was in heaven. And bad beer. It's bad beer. A re I love it's it. a reoccurring theme. I bad beer retro, and punk retro, rock I music. It. Well, no, I like the I like the way it, it tastes. Yeah, <laughs> everybody's. Yeah, it's, it's a big thing. Now. Again, like I always say, why should anybody just select one brand of beer for their entire? I've been drinking Old Style for forty-two years. Well, no, try everything. I like. A, everything. I, you know, actually, I, I, I'm kind of a schnob. I like Guinness Stout. Guinness Stout. Yeah, that's good stuff. I was drinking man. some Honey Weiss or something last night. It was good. Lining Kugel. Yeah, Lining Kugel. It's good. Lining's. <laughs> that's uh, Hayward, Wisconsin. Yeah, Hayward, Rory Wisconsin. Legends from the, from Where they do the log rolling. Been there, done that. Been there. Have, Have you been there, Jared? Got a, got a couple of Lumberjacks autographs. Really? <laughs> One of a wood chip toss. Hey, hey, Jared just joining us. I think well, Nicholas H. actually won a cow chip toss or something like that. Oh, <laughs> did he now? Yeah. I, was, no, he I, was, I, actually, I thought he was a cow chip catcher. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. <laughs> no, that was very good. I got it. That was very good. 
cow chip and cow chip catcher. Yeah. Uh, actually, I went to uh, Dirty Nelly's up there in Palatine. You did. Have wow. you ever played there, Grusel? Never. No. But what happened there? Uh, Johnny B. Oh, you, you, you got you yeah. went to a Johnny B. Well, I want I, tickets. I've, I've often want to... I've often pondered the fact because they give all those tickets away because nobody wants to see this guy. And there I'm was... thinking to myself, <laughs> nobody would who would go them. see a Trevor Johnny B him. concert there was, and then watch Trevor there, Blanchard. There You're 800. the guy that would go. There Trevor is. is. He's like so like old Chicago. I there think. Like, oh, he's, he's so, fan, so, he's so just... not funny. <laughs> he's not. He's not funny. Oh, no, I'm talking about Trevor. Oh, well. Oh, are you it, talking about Trevor? No, I'm talking about oh. Johnny B. Oh, yeah. Well, Johnny B's not funny. So no in conclusion, Trevor, not funny at all. Thanks, man. Oh. So, hey, oh, how you, was it, though? How was Johnny, Johnny B? B. Was really Johnny cool. B. There was 800 people. Um, oh, 800, wall, 800 wall, idiots. Wall, no, no, it was 800 it was idiots. It was about as big as their studio. Really? Yes. And played for an hour and 45 minutes, just the same way like he was 20 years ago. I was <laughs> just as boring. No, man. They put on, <laughs> put on a hell of a show. Yeah. You know what? Actually, I did, I did give his producer one of my cards. Well, so. good. Yeah. That's good. At least you were well, networking. And then his producer turned around networking. and went whoop into a circular file like. Yeah. Can't. What? From bad beer to bad entertainment. Gotta love it. Right? <laughs> Only here on our forum for pro sports. And both can lead to gout. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Rich food. And, yeah, she's a good girl. She's crazy about her mama. <laughs> loves she loves Jesus. Billy Wack and Trevor Blanchard, too. Anyways, uh, our next match coming up will be from Ringside Pro Wrestling. Justin Adams taking on Silas Young. Um, I, I sense a theme starting here. Justin Adams, Silas Young. Haven't we watched them the past four weeks in a row? This match had better Almost be like good. No, this match had better break. be good. I'm going to go on record right here tonight and say this match had better be good. Well, if not, we just charge the... Charge the uh, control room. Oh! Slap, slap, charge! Remember, remember, remember when we tied Nicholas like the bush up? And yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll go in like the bushwhack. We'll give the full story. We, we tied him to a chair and we took over the control room. Trevor's like, remember when we tied Nicholas H up? <laughs> in the control room. That had a little been, more so yeah. they don't think we're... That had to have been fun. Yeah, it was yeah, all right. Here. Yeah, I wish I would have been. Yeah, well, he fell asleep at the chair, so out came the, the rope. Him. Came one of those duct tape rope things we had here. Did you put any, like, nail polish on him? No, no, no. Could have put peanut butter in his ears. Eggshells egg shells on his ears. Yeah, yeah. Uh, dressed him up a little bit. He's a pretty son of a gun. He's a pretty boy. We love that Nick. And I, uh, there's either a helicopter landing on the roof, or that's the tornado sign. So let's go to this match. Let's Ringside Pro Wrestling, Justin Adams, Silas Young. Oh, hey, the wow. Yeah. Another beautifully shot match, though. This sure is good is. stuff. And uh, uh, speaking of themes, once again, your referee, Nicholas H. Yeah, well, he is the consummate ring professional. Look at him. He gets out of the way. He knows what he's supposed to do. I give Nichols H all the credit in the world as a ref. But uh, sometimes he's bigger than the, re the wrestlers, though. He's a, he's a, when he gets in there and manages, he's a tough dude, too. you got to watch out for Nichols H. And again, what, uh, what company is this? Ringside Pro. Ringside Pro Wrestling. Do they have a website? If you look at the flyer I brought into the studio. Oh, Nicholas H. Wow. See, Nicholas H. right now. Suddenly prompting us through headset. Yeah, Nicholas H. assumes that, that we were stunted in our intelligence, so he has to talk slow. I couldn't I, hear hey, you, Hey, Joey Nick. Matthews. You talk look, it's Joey Matthews. <laughs> if you look at the flyer. It's little, no, not Joey Matthews. It's, it's uh, Joey, Eastman. Oh, Joey, Joey Eastman. Eastman, and he's also known as... Carruthers, what's his name? Carruthers, no, Lucas. Lucas, yeah, Lucas the mucus, yeah, he's in there. But I think, I think it was all, that was all a, an act. I think this is the real Joey Eastman that we've been seeing. Joey Eastman, I would have to say, is the premier ring announcer in Chicago wrestling. Is he? Yeah, I, I think he's the best. Then that means I need to come out of semi-retirement. Him, <laughs> him and Tom Schreiber, if I had to pick my top two. Tom and Tom is... Totally professional. Yeah, Tom totally Schreiber, nice guy, great ring announcer, and I got to give all the props to the aforementioned gentleman, Joey Eastman. Props to well. Joey Eastman. He does have that booming ring announcer voice. Yeah, straight up. Straight up WWE quality. Yes. I will give him all the credit in the world. One day we might see him in WWE or TNA. Well, anyways, that, um, that uh, website you guys were asking about, about uh, Ringside Pro Wrestling, it's at uh, myspace.com slash ringside pro wrestling. Well, thank wow. you, Trevor. So. Do you have a MySpace, Trevor? No. Uh. I do. I think it's Gruesome. Lisa, what is it? Gruesome Dave? What's my MySpace called? Gruesome Dave? Oh, oh, I went to it, and I sent a friend request like a couple months ago. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I sorry. I don't type. I don't type. Yeah. You don't have You have to click. My computer says, got you, yanked. Would you like to be kitchen? friends with Billy Wack? And you said, thus far, no. Oh, no. I just I don't type, so I don't go on it. I, I, but I would like to go back to my MySpace. Silas Young throwing Justin Adams in up and over. Nice. Oh, man, got him just, on his shoulder. Just the barely caught him. Headlock, side headlock takeover, and Adams 
Got has Silas down on the mat. Nicholas H checking in, and Joey Eastman. What is with that candy cane tie? <laughs> you like that? <laughs> he's getting ready Joe for Eastman. Christmas. He's making a statement. It's kind of short, don't you think? You know, a lot of guys don't know how to tie ties. No, I went to a Catholic high school, so we had to learn how to tie ties. But a lot of people, you know what I mean, if they go through life and never go to a school where they have to wear a tie, don't learn how. So they have their wives or auntie or whoever tie it for them. Ironically, Luckily, the, I it's the girls that know you, how to you tie the ties. You, you can't tie a tie? I, uh, I can't. I just don't like it. Yeah, I don't like them either, really, but I can, I can do it. And what, the funny thing was I went to high school in the 70s, and in the 70s it was like a big contest because we didn't want to wear the ties. How short, <laughs> how short you could make the tie and big and fat and stupid. Like the Undertaker? The, the Undertaker right, tie? the Undertaker tie. It was almost like a contest to have as little bit of tie sticking over your shirt as possible. And some of these ties, you can see school pictures from the 70s at Bishop Knoll where well, I went. High school and in these, the 70s? Yeah, Jeez. and these, I'm telling you, these ties are like this short. It looks like the hair bear bunch would wear. They're hilarious. <laughs> So I've tied some bad ties in my time, gentlemen. Wow. And Joe Eastman, I'm sure, tied on a few as well. Hey, Just, he just took it off. Justin Adams. Maybe it was a clip tie. <laughs> Sorry about that tie-in. I didn't mean to digress from no. Justin Adams. <laughs> Justin still has a headlock on there on Silas Young. Silas picking him up. Ooh, oh, whoa. Oh. He's able to bring him back over. Side headlock takeover. Nicholas H. again going in there and checking in. Uh, you know, I don't know if uh, Justin Adams has won the Windy City Award for Most Improved, and I'm not even sure if he works exclusively. For, obviously, doesn't work exclusively for Windy City anymore. But this guy, I'd have to say, in the past three years, is the most improved wrestler. Now, isn't this the kid that went to the to the high school? Yeah, we were, were talking about him last anyone? week because he was yeah, on he came last out week. To uh, roller coaster, right? To a roller coaster. Roller coaster, that song. Oh, maybe, yeah, I mean, ro love roller coaster, right? Yeah. Perhaps. But uh, I got to admit, uh, he was a kind of a cocky young upstart when he first came in. I didn't really think much of that guy. But uh, I'd have to say in the past three years, he's the most improved in Chicago wrestling. I'll give him some props. Jumping so over Silas. Going for the hip toss. Reverse. Boom. Very nice. Going for a pin. Ooh, look at that. Off. Loving that. Going for another hip toss. Going for the backslide. Does Adams on to Silas. Silas fights it off. Scoops him up. Floats over. One, two, bridge Whoa, up. Whoa, look bridge. at that, Trevor, you're on Trevor, top of it. Yeah, Trevor, he's just, let him go. He's on fire. Yes, he is. Dropped him, dropped him right back down, and he fell right on uh, Justin Adams' face, did Silas Young. And I'm just staring at the wild gestures of one Nicholas H. <laughs> yeah! Like he's like, he's like air Ooh, traffic controller, run. Nicholas H. <laughs> yeah! Well, he's so tall. Yeah. And he hates flying, man. He looks oh, like that yeah, guy from the stories. Devil's Rejects. You ever see the Devil's <laughs> yeah. Rejects? Bill Mosley? He looks like Bill Mosley from the Devil's Rejects. Totally. <laughs> we got to get Nicholas H. We'll do, Ooh, we should do, our little, we should do like a little silence. promo like that where we actually come in and, and Nicholas H. is a Devil's Reject. And Billy Wack, you could be Captain Spaulding. Wait, who's the captain? Wait, which captain, guy? That's the guy with the clown makeup. Oh, all right. Hey, I'm he in. plays him. Whoa, up and yeah. over does go Adams. Here we go. Look at Joey Eastman. He's not... He, He's not doing a thing. He's not doing a thing. He's airing out his armpits. Oh, he's wait, wait, the, wait, 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 wait. He's got the tie, the tie off. off. He's got the, and he's no. strangling him. No, Eastman, no. Look at this. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. He really tries to conceal it as he runs away. That son of a. He's flamboyant, he is. Ran like a fairy. Yeah, he did. He ran like a flamboyant. He's flamboyant, <laughs> flamboyant. I'll tell you. Oh, oh, look at that. <laughs> look at him. Now he's, he's got something else. Oh, oh, whoa. Whoa. oh look at this. right in the ribs. Joey Eastman back there. Oh, pats him on the back. Very proud of Silas Young, the damage he's doing. Ooh. Oh, wow. Devastating elbow. Hooking both legs. One, two. Nicholas H. a little slow on that count. Maybe he's getting too old to be in there. Mm. Silas Young, I'm telling you, this guy, he is a ring veteran. Every time we see him That's here on the mat. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Right into the solar plexus. Would that be a stomach breaker? Stomach buster? Neat, neat stomach buster. Gut strike. I that, don't know. Ooh, a million man. of them. Let's come up. That'll hoit. Ooh, kick right to the Look at that. Of the temple. Gotta love it right here. Crystal clear wrestling action as per usual here on On the Mat. Joe Eastman strutting his stuff at ringside. Very pleased with his man. You know what? What? And, and you, hopefully you'll agree with me, but when when uh, Silas pushed him into the ropes towards towards us, mm -hmm. nice belly to back. Or, yes, it was. Side suplex. Mm -hmm. um, Justin Adams looked a little resembled one, two. Only a Jim two. Brunzel. Trevor's telling Jim a story Brunzel. and doing commentary. Jim Brunzel, yeah, I can, I can see it. I can see it. Sure, Trev, sure. Uh-oh, from behind, got that chin, cinches it up. And look, look at Joey hell? Eastman is just pleased doing? with himself. Yeah, he's, he's pleasing, pleasing himself. <laughs> yeah, I think he is, right. <laughs> I believe you're right, Billy. 
Maybe, maybe we can edit that out. Yeah, I don't want anybody else. When I think about you, I touch myself. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, Look at this. Silas oh, Young. Feet on the ropes, but do doing his damage nonetheless, Silas Young. And of course, those feet on the second ropes. If it was on the third ropes, it could have killed him. Look at this. Look at him. Now he's got the foot on the ropes. He's assisting he him, giving get, a leverage. Nicholas have, H doesn't even see. Oh, now he caught leverage. it. You know, not enough leverage. Nicholas H, you would think he would be watching the shows, and you know, he's always refereeing these matches. But he'd look at it and go, "Oh man, I sure blew that." You know, like. <laughs> that was very good. <laughs> <laughs> that was very good there, Ben. Yeah, man, I, I, I oh, pretty blew good, that. Nicholas H. <laughs> oh, look at that forearm strike to the back. Next time, I'll be ready for that kind of all that chicanery. But he's not, because next week we're going to have a series of matches featuring Nicholas H where he's just not Why? paying attention. Yeah. Uh, Nicholas H. Well, <laughs> Nicholas H is not in the studio right now, so we're getting, away, we're getting away with worried. murder, oh, yeah. fans. We're just opening, his, him up, uh, opening up on him. He's worried about his double wide getting towed. Ooh. Yeah. Double wide trailer. He's got double wide toes? Trailer. Oh. I'm going to go out trailer. Saturday night and regulate the fights. <laughs> Ooh, man, look at those elbows. Down goes Silas Young off the second rope. Watch Eastman there. Just, right. Justin Where'd Adams needs to get off those ropes and get back into the mix if he can. Uh-oh, from behind, Silas oh, Young. Ooh. Right to the kidneys. The kidneys. Yeah, that'll hoit. You've been struck there before, right, Trevor? The uh, once, when I worked with WCW. In, in your Fit Finley wow. kicked me in the back. Very nice flow. Yeah. One, One two. two. Fit Fit Finley. Finley How many people can say that? Fit Finley, Fit Finley kicked me in the back. How many people can say? My legs went numb for How many about 30 people, seconds. How many people have had a career that spans over 400 years can say they've only been kicked in the kidneys once? Yeah. Trevor, that's what I want to know. He must be protecting himself. Right. I told you he was good. All right. Silas Young. <laughs> 400 what? years. You're a bastard. You know what? <laughs> hey, now. <laughs> Yeah. You're not too far behind me. Don't get now. Nicholas H. riled up. He's going to call I'm you not. a B-bomb. Joey not. Eastman once again running around at ringside. Suplex attempt and snaps him over. Very That's nice. Silas Young. Over, Nicholas H. Runs. One, two, and it's a... Oh, kick out at two. Silas Young right. says, come on with it, Nicholas H. What's up? Speed it up. One, two, three, baby. Whoa, look at this. Opens up with chops. Smacking him across. Four, Here we go. And he throws him right out, oh. and, and guaranteed Eastman will be Justin Adams, around. Justin Adams to the outside. Now he has to contend with Joey there Eastman. And the tie's already off. Look at this. Here he comes. You're hey right. Guys, Nicholas H is back in the control room. Hey, he's strangling out. somebody on the outside. Does he get Justin Adams? I can't see from my vantage point, but it looks like he just strangled Justin Adams. And then he waves the tie around in celebration. Yeah. Oh, my. It's just mocking Justin Adams, Not basically. a good night for Adams. No, definitely not. Oh, look at this. Again. Both legs, too. This is, I, I thought that was going to be it. I don't believe he actually kicked out of that. Unbelievable. Look Unbelievable. At the face. Look at the lighting on this match. This is really nice stuff. Hey, he says, shoot. Here it comes. Uh-oh. He, it's it? it's <laughs> time for Bob's feet. Oh. Bam! Down Get he right goes. To the chest. That'll knock the wind out of you. That's right. We didn't hear it, but I'm sure that crowd did. That could stop your heart. Yeah. Justin Adams could be seizing up. He could be dying right One, now. Two. Two. Just like Ox Baker he, with the heart he, punch. The heart punch. I was thinking the same thing about the Justin heart Adams punch. may have died there, and now he's already come back to life and is a zombie. Zombie Justin Adams. There wow. Go. He's got a, now he's got a gimmick. Yeah. There's your uh, zombie Justin Adams. Pro Papa Shango. MySpace.com slash ringside pro wrestling. And I would de definitely, definitely this. check it out. It looks like they've got some good production. The lighting looks good. The ring yep. looks good. The rail. they got guardrails. Do you uh, and how about that ref? <laughs> and then they've got the rough. Easy now, guys. <laughs> do, you, do you remember uh, when Ox Baker well, punched Al Lerner from WG? No, I didn't. I, I, no. I've met Al Look Lerner. At I was an extra in a movie with him once. He's in agony watching this. Nichols, they should throw in the towel. He should stop this match. Al Lerner, Chicago wrestling historian. Yes. Glad to mention him here. Big shout out to Al. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at that. He's fighting his way out. He's bringing out any kind of clubbing maneuver. He can get uh, uh, Silas Young off his back, and he actually, succeeded in doing so. Actually, another radio guy that's a big wrestling fan was uh, Eddie Schwartz. Eddie Schwartz, boy. Chicago Ed. Man, he, Whoa, you, you, man. Do, you do listen to wow. some nerdy media, Trevor. I'll tell you, between Spike O'Dell and Jonathan Brandmeier, you need some drive-time help, son. That's, that's got to be it. I can't believe that. Look at this! Whoa! Whoa. Package. One, two, eight. Oh my goodness! Silas Young back up with a kick fighting. Silas Young is in for the kill. He wants to end this thing right now. Look at that uppercut. Unbelievable wrestling action. I'm loving it Shoots tonight, him off guys. Into the corner. Adams hits it, puts a foot up, and he blocks he it. He blocks it. Silas throws yeah. it down. Crusty veteran. 
Whoa! He missed he, that. I don't think he, he went for a. Uh, he went for it. No. He kick. didn't. He, missed he it. didn't catch him with that. That missed completely. And now Silas he's Young. Silas going up. He's ready to capitalize, and I know he's going to. Look at this. Uh -oh. That's yeah. on the top rope. Oh! But he telegraphed and he got out the way. How could you not telegraph? Oh! Look at that. Big Justin spear. Adams. Second spear we've seen tonight. Big stuff here on on the mat. Your forum for independent wrestling week in and week out right here on Comcast. Nicholas H. making the count. Duh. Oh, you're bad, <laughs> Billy. You're that? so Duh. bad, Billy. <laughs> you know, they're doing a Wait, musical I, Adams family. Maybe I they would, could get Nicholas H. to play Lurch. I would love to. I would love to add, like, since, since we don't have sound, I'd love to add, like, a gunshot go. <laughs> <laughs> every time he plays. Well, every time he counts. A shotgun. <laughs> Look at that. You mentioned Nicholas H is the musical lurch. <laughs> Look at this. You the chop rang. Here we this go. He's exchanging chops. Whoa! Whoa. Look at that clothesline. He's been beside himself. Another clothesline. Nicholas H fixing his hair. Justin Look Adams, there. he's a house of fire, kids. Look at him oh. flying off the second row. Second one, two. None of Man. I think Silas thought he could catch him there, but the forward momentum of Justin Adams carried him over. Now he's calling for a timeout. This here is what I would call an independent classic, guys. This is a good this one. This is good. We are in the midst of a great match, and here comes Even Joey Eastman. Even despite Joey Eastman. Oh, no, look at that. Right to the stomach. Look at this. He blocks it. Justin Adams says, uh-uh, you're going face first first, fool. Two. There he goes, walking him around the corners. Three, do we have? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> look at that. Wow. Picks him up. Whoa! Oh, man, just flapjack, set Flapjack, single leg flapjack. Come on, Justin Adams, you can do Take this. One, Eastman. two. Oh, man. Get I'm even up. rooting for the kid. I'm, I, You know what? He's really showing me something here tonight. And Joey Eastman sticking himself Why involved, getting involved. Why to get to the corner? I, they, I think they ought to eject him from the building, quite frankly. But, hey, you know, I used to be a manager. I, you know, I know he's running his game. He's doing his job. Silas Young getting into his feet. Justin Adams is what he can try. No, he was go I think he was going for a pile driver. Oh, man. Punishing. Just jamming Three him right in there. Yeah. A back <laughs> elbow. <laughs> Pew! Pew! <laughs> bing, bing. Or, or spitting into a pile. Uh, Whoa, boom! Power slam by Adams on the surface. Oh, two in like nine tenths right there. Justin Adams, he's applying his trade all over Chicago wrestling he now. He was a spit of tobacco away from getting a win. He sure was. Yes, he was. He was that close. Oh, man, Silas Young. You're clubbing. He's been right there. Yeah, Nicholas H. Nicholas H right there. Not even paying attention. Nick, Going this is, for it again. Nick, this is Joe Eastman. Joe Eastman, Nicholas H. Uh, Joe oh. Eastman shouldn't be getting involved in the match. They got a follow One, spot two. on this match, I believe. I see a follow spot. That's pretty cool. Got to love it. This is a good match. Yeah, good old time wrestling right here tonight. On the mat, bringing you the best of professional wrestling every week. Going for the clothesline again. Oh, oh my oh. goodness. Oh, man. Wow. I would hate to have that happen to my back. Oh, man. Slam oh, into God, that's, that's that got to be it. Brutal. One, One, two. Yeah, that should be it. Oh. oh, my goodness. And Joey Eastman's just walking the floor, what Daddy. What does Silas Young have to do to put this youngster away? I don't know. I, that that is a rep. great question. Yeah. Get a different rep. <laughs> Uh-oh. Go for the Boston Crab, something you don't see very often. Justin Nicholas Adams. H. I think Doing Justin Adams might again. submit at this point. If he can't bridge <laughs> out or reach the ropes, he's in trouble here. Trying to Look at him! He's doing it! Wow. Look at the strength of Justin Adams! Right, He's fighting his way to the ropes! He might oh, no, no, no! He pulls wow. him back in! The ring presence of Silas Young, gotta give him Joey credit. Eastman just prowling around grinning. He's happy. Yeah, he is. Just like, just like that little girl with the Heart of the Mania t-shirt. Oh, going into a, sun, uh, into a sunset. A modified one. Now he's just punching on. Not, nah, it's a brawl. I have it on good authority that that little girl in the front row with the Hulkamania t-shirt, that's Hulk Hogan's niece. She's Wendy Hogan. Surely you're just. Ah, yes, surely. Adam's <laughs> kicking oh, no. Silas off. Oh, surely. <laughs> Here Whoa. we go, what a chop! These two men are fighting for their lives right now. Oh, look at that. Second shot. I'm telling you, we have got ourselves a barn burner right here, a Downey Brook, as it were. Breaker. Oh, ooh, just Ow. put him Very down. Awkward. Yeah, but nonetheless, I have a feeling that you're just as devastating. Yes, exactly. Not hooking a leg. Whoa, Nicholas H down there quicker than the hiccup, and it was only a uh, two count. He's saying. If he would have been able to, if Silas would have been able to hook the leg, he might have had him. 
Yeah, it was that close. Or a different referee. And Nicholas H., I figured out what the H stands for. It's, it's Haggard. Look how, <laughs> oh, look how God, Haggard is. He's just, oh. You're bad. Dude. Dude. Oh, man. Haggard like the flags? No, no. No, those are Hagar. These are Hagar. Oh, yeah. See, Hager. Yeah, just ask, an old, just ask an old man. We look, know what yeah. those pants are. Look at the... Look at the monitor. Right, Trevor. Uh, Trevor oh, look at this. Hey, on. Billy, Where's Trevor wears Sanza belt still. You Sanza know? what? Sanza belt. I, yeah. I don't know. What it's a pair of pants without a belt. See? Oh, Sanza belt. You don't need a belt. There's no loops. It's got this little strap, see? Yeah. It's a strap on. Well, it, Trevor's but... never really held a belt, so why would he put one on to hold up his pants? <laughs> yeah, okay, Jared. That'll be about oh, enough out of you. Two, go for another bridge. Oh, bridge is out. Yeah, right, they got those two right. Yeah, I, I, those Look at this. Look at this. Oh, oh, that's Young. okay, Jared. I think he hit the post. Shoulder right on the post. Kick what a kick. No, he's going for that. Pile driver Ooh, again. Oh, my goodness. Whoa. Ouch. Oh, man, he planted him. Now, like come those, on. Those Jerry Lawler Memphis pile driver. Yes, one, it was. Two, three. three. Oh, yeah. big win man. for Justin Adams. That was a three, right, guys? Yep. Yeah. Wow. What a match. What a hard-fought win for Justin Adams, right?